It's a feisty little crawfish. Oh, he's got him. Oh, 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 oh. Dang. I know you guys saw that. He just caught him midair. That's my guy right there. What's up, everybody? So I just came back from fishing. I have managed to catch two catfish. One is in this 49-gallon tank. Or is it 45 gallon tank? I don't remember. I just did a water change for it. So it's still kind of cloudy, but my filter right now is making sure that it clears up. So within about 30 minutes to an hour, it's gonna clear back up. As you can see, I got a really big catfish in here. And I know what you're thinking. Hey, you can't keep that in there. And you're absolutely right. But I thought, hey, you know, I could do it for a video. The truth is, is that this is going to be dinner. I'm also going to be going to a fish store to grab me some fish for the 125 gallon tank. But I just wanted to show you guys this big catfish. He's really big. When I first put him in here, he was just thrashing about. I thought he was gonna bust this tank wide open, baby. Luckily, that didn't happen. Um, and then I do have another catfish. Let me go ahead and show you guys that one. All right, so this one's not looking so good. He was doing fine earlier, but he's not doing so good now. The reason being is because when I caught this fish, the only thing that I had to transport him with is a small bucket. I took both of them and they were both in this small five gallon bucket, just cramped, and they were in there for a good 30 minutes. Let's see if I can actually flip him on his side. That would be cool though if I had a catfish as big as this one that actually where I can actually uh, have a suitable aquarium for him, but unfortunately I don't have an aquarium that can house a fish this big. I thought about putting them in the 125, but you know, the 125 is already stocked as it is. Overstocked, I mean, sorry. But yeah, whenever they start doing this, any fish that starts to do this, you know, it's about time for them to go. He has a big old belly. I wonder if fish are ticklish. I should make an experiment on that. Come on, buddy. I need you for a thumbnail. I need you to flip over. There you go. There you go, baby. Oh. I think I made it just in time for the thumbnail. Let me try one more time. Yeah, buddy, you're a goner. All right, well, whenever I get back from the fish store, I'm gonna fillet the two catfish, and I'm gonna show you guys what I get from the fish store. By the way, is this tadpole fixing to be a bullfrog pretty soon? And if so, like, I'm just so lost. So lost as to what to do with uh, these tadpoles whenever they tr fully transform. I have like a spare 20 gallon tank that I could probably put them in. Do you guys think I should set up a 20 gallon tank for these tadpoles right now or should I just wait? Leave a comment down below and let me know. Help me out. Yeah! So I am back from the fish store. I didn't get fish. I got some food for the uh, prawn shrimp right here. So I'm going to be feeding him something special today. But first, I got to get this catfish out of here and fillet him. I won't show you guys the filleting part because some of you guys probably don't want to see that. So whenever I'm done filleting the fish, I'll just cut to show you guys the meat. If you've never eaten fresh catfish, you're missing out because catfish is delicious. All right, guys. So I filleted the catfish. I got one piece. I'm good to go. All right, guys, finally, moment of truth. So this is my prawn shrimp, and he's really big, he's really cool, and he loves to eat. 
that's what he loves to do. I fed him goldfish, shiners, and I fed him a frozen rat before. He ate all of those things with no problems. Anything I give him, he's going to eat. Today I decided I'm going to try to feed him a blue lobster and a albino frog. So I'm going to go ahead and put the frog in first and see how he does. Alright guys, so here he is. This is what I'm going to feed my prawn shrimp. Let's go ahead and do this. In you go. Oh. He senses it. Come on, buddy. Get him. He's backtracking now. He's backtracking. He knows something's in the tank. Come on, boy. Turn around. That's right. Turn around. Oh, he sees it. Oh, and he got him. I honestly thought the frog was going to get away. <laughs> oh, man. You are just tearing that thing up now, boy. Is the frog going to get away? Let's see. Maybe he doesn't like frog. I'm pretty sure he'll eat him. Oh, he's going to eat him. Leg first. Brutal. That's my guy right there. Maybe he'll spit him out. Oh, he's kind of struggling to eat that. Oh, the frog's putting up a fight. That frog's trying to escape. Guys, nothing but a leg left. Looks like he's almost done eating. I'm gonna give him a few more minutes and then I'll feed him the blue lobster. Alright, guys, here's the blue lobster. It's his turn now. Pretty sure we'll put up a good fight. Let's see what happens. Alright, in he goes. Just gonna get right on top of him. Oh, what's gonna happen? Oh, they're fighting. They're fighting. Oh, he's got him. He's got him. Oh, he's putting up a fight. Oh, he's pinching the crap out of his pincher. Get him, boy. Get him. Or is this gonna be a draw? Oh, no. That's a feisty little crawfish. Oh, he's got him. Get him. Get him. I'm not sure if he'll eat him. I think he's gonna give up on him. Get him. Come on, get him. You're like three times his size. That blue crawfish is pinching the crap out of his pincher. I think he's got him now. Oh. Uh oh. Oh. 
Oh, you got him by the face. Oh. <laughs> He's dragging him. Oh, shit. It's getting crazy in this fish tank. You gotta give the blue one props though, he's putting up a good fight. Oh, it looks like he hit a soft spot there. Oh, looks like you finally have a fair fight. Oh, he's gonna get him now. I think he's gonna tear him open. Oh, yeah. I think he's got him now. Belly's exposed now. Get his belly. Get him. Oh. And he hits him again. Now he's got him backed up into a corner. Oh, he almost had him. He's gonna get him again. The battle of the lobsters. Oh, he's eating his pinchers now. Oh, that's so crazy. He's eating his pinchers. Oh. <laughs> Or he was trying to. Go for his belly, dude. Why do you keep messing with his pictures? Oh, oh no. He's got him now. I thought he did. Uh oh, blue lobster's got him. No. Man, I thought this was gonna be a, a flawless victory, but I guess not. My boy taking some damage. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa. Dang. I know you guys saw that. He just caught him in midair. 